In separate or together? Uh, together. I'm gonna pay for it. I know, that's right. Ladies, I want to believe that he's lying, but just in case, just in case, smile. Thank you. The whole is giving, I know that's right, as he should. It is tacky. It is not cute. Gratitude will always be in style. Bro, I'm sure that this type of attitude and entitlement ruin 99% of dates nowadays. She is 100% correct. Being grateful when someone else pays is good manners and it's also polite. If you're gonna start acting disrespectful and entitled, then pay for your own meal. Simple as that. Okay, ladies, hear me out. Only fans, but it's just one fan and you have his children and he takes care of you for the rest of your life. <laughs> Is your best friend? You never. <laughs> well, how long are you gonna keep leading him on like this? <laughs> you pay this whole bill? Don't pay the whole bill. You split as friends. As friends, best friends ever. Everybody say, if he pays for the bill, he's the what? <laughs> they said it, not me. <laughs> Yeah, you want her? Cute guy, huh? Hey, sit next to her. Come sit next to her. Empty chair in here. Hey, if, hey, 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 if she's your best friend, she'll understand. Sit right here. Sit down right there, my boy! Oh! 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 I love you, boy! That's how we're doing this Hey, Miami, we love you! Hey, she looks mad as fuck. I guess no more free meals for her. Respect to the comedian, bro. He saved him from a problem and a red flag. If she is his friend, she would understand. Why would she be angry if he finds a woman that wants to be in a relationship with him? It's like they're friends, but she needs all the attention to herself. And guys, please don't put yourself in situations like this, where you stay friends with a woman because you believe that one day she might let you hit. If that's how you think, you're delusional. Make your intentions with her very clear from the start. And if she rejects you, move on. Plenty of fish out there. You know what they say, married Cowboys fan, you get used to the disappointment. You'll see the disappointment Monday, for sure. Oh my God, there he goes. You know what they say, marry a woman with a child and you always have a reason to leave. Oh, you better come here, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm a very freaky girl. I get it from my mama. What the fuck you just say, look? I'm a very freaky girl. I, feel I get it from my mama. You don't get shit from me. Very freaky girl. I don't girl. do no shit. Nobody fucking hum. Why you got five kids? Because <laughs> I'm a bitch. My wife, she'll get upset if she sees you touching me like that on my chest. I am your wife. <laughs> Sup? <laughs> oh, oh, throw it. <laughs> Potter, the boy who lived, um, died. That's good. <laughs> girl's name what do you mean yeah say a girl's name uh, why say it uh, I don't know Jessica Jessica <laughs> who's Jessica <laughs> Bro, what the fuck is this insanity and craziness this is one of the most stupidest trends that I've ever seen on the internet name a woman name a woman name a woman
I'm Danny. I'm Jake. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're kind of cute. Is this like a social experiment or some shit? What do you... I don't know. Why? Are you experimenting on me? What the heck? I might be. I don't know. What? What? I don't know. I was just wanting to get your number. Okay. I'll put it in if you want me to. Okay. Are you fucking... What are you doing? <laughs> I'm fun. You're freaking me out. I'm fun. What do you mean? You're holding on to my hand. I'll, I'm gonna put my. I was just shaking your hand. Okay. I oh, know it's a long handshake. It's fine. Oh, I mean, I don't know. How long are these supposed to be? I don't know, like five seconds. No wonder everyone thinks I'm weird. I get the same thing. People think you're weird. Not, not weird. <laughs> Unique. Oh. Why are you, are you messing with me? Maybe. <laughs> Can't tell. Are you, you're pranking me. <laughs> what are you talking about? Wait, is this one of those TikTok videos? That's what I thought. <laughs> is that food? Yeah, I cut around the, the f When she's tired of dating men, then come on over here, shoddy. So what you're saying is, is that it is a choice. Interesting. Man, that's... you already know. For all the hardworking men out there, there are still women that will have dinner ready for you when you get home. The house clean, fresh clothes, and a beer waiting. Yeah, there's plenty of women out there still like that. So don't go settle in for less. Bro, it's astonishing to me how they promote their OnlyFans. It's kind of creative, I'm not gonna lie. Too bad you're just like the rest of them. I got a question. <laughs> Will we be able to play a game tonight? I don't play games. It's called Tug of War. <laughs> and I'm bringing the rope. What does that even mean? It means grip me and pull me. <laughs> You're disgusting. Okay, I love you. Love you. Night. What's the equivalent of getting a girl flowers from me? Yeah. Anything related to tax fraud, Microsoft Excel, or maximizing shareholder value. Thank me later. Would you go into a relationship with a man that earns less than you? Yeah, I would. Why? I would make him richer. Wow. Because there is difference, you know, between a good wife and being a bad wife. Because if you always stress him, he will never make it. And if you always take his time and you don't care about his future, what he really wants to achieve, then you will never get a rich man. It's impossible for women after 40 to find a boyfriend. I have no children, I cook delicious food, and I have a big house. Am I really that bad? This is extremely sad, and unfortunately it seems a lot of women are finding themselves in this exact same position, and the reason they're finding themselves there is because feminists for the last 40 years have told women that they need the boss babe, and the most empowering form of womanhood is to be a half-rate bastardized version of what you think a man is like, go and climb the corporate ladder, sleep with as many people as you possibly can, and you'll be super fulfilled until you hit 40 years old, your biological clock has run out, you can't have children, and no man wants to marry you. And I don't say all of this to make fun of this woman, I actually feel very badly for her, but the reality is we have to warn future generations of young women that this is not a position you want to find yourself in at age 40. Reject the feminist propaganda. Yeah, what he's saying is absolutely true. But I never feel sorry for a woman who made her own bad decisions and choices in life she had her opportunities when she was young and now when she reached a certain age she starts complaining and asking about where all the good men are the good men are already married to the good women so just stop complaining and take responsibility for your own life choices i'm sorry but i don't feel bad for these types of women you had your opportunity and you missed it i'm making six cheeseburgers while everyone's walking around with their fucking dicks in their hands <laughs> else to help you relax i mean i'm like i take baths i'm pisces yeah i drink i'm an alcoholic <laughs> so we hey excuse me sir i have a question yeah. what aisle do i go to to find a girlfriend who doesn't make me wake up at one in the morning to buy cheerios uh i think it's like aisle three but oh shit right thank you zach you're a real one <laughs> see ya why'd you chop spider-man's head I'll off and put off. it on your shelf that's the real question i could chop your head off and put it under the mask if you want that's so romantic are you flirting yeah. Oh, that's the best way of flirting ever. You really think about it, that's free head every day. Yeah.